In October of 1972, Rod Temple and two of his friends diving near Kane Bay was brutally attacked by two oceanic white-tipped sharks. As soon as he was by himself, the sharks ripped and tore Rod's flesh apart as he squirmed in agony. One of his friends, Brett Gilliam, rushed to his aid and tried helping him fight off his attackers but was instead dragged deeper alongside him. The two sharks stopped attacking after biting off Rod's left leg to eat it, but soon came back for another round. After losing the battle and surrendering his friend's lifeless remains to the vicious sharks, Brett was forced to swim almost 400 feet to reach the surface, all with barely any oxygen left and no time to complete his decompression sequence. Brett's body would later be found unconscious on the beach, later being transported to the hospital where he was discharged two days later. Rod Temple was never seen again. <laughs>